didn't realize that, so. Because then I get more chips. And the big flip out. <laughs> Hope you have an even better year. <laughs> I mean, it'd be nice, but it seems somewhat unlikely. Uh, squeeze Ace Queen here. Go to Queen 7 3. Couple of hearts. Just got a fucking walk with aces at 1k. Oh my god, back to back aces. Uh, King on a turn, I am going to go for a really small bet still. Still some hands that um, I want to call. Get it in against eights. Um, Ace Queen, he folds on the turn. Nice, we hold that. I forgot to have run it twice then. Uh, so if I'd have lost that, would have been a bit upset. Right, sixes, flop sets. We check raise the flop. Uh, we're going to check the turn. And check shove the river, depending on what the river is. Six would be nice. Yeah, check shoving river. And hopefully he doesn't have 8-5 suited. Or can he have 8-6 suited? 8-6 of spades, I guess. Maybe as well where he defends 8-6 off, but he shouldn't. And he folds one for the red line. Still a $500 part. We take it. I'm going to go for the check raise here. Um, we check call flop. Uh, going to go for the check raise. Could also check call. This card's pretty good for us in general as button. Uh, as big blind, sorry. And also he still has seven, like a load of 7x because he's on the button. So when we unblock. Like I'd rather check raise fives than check raise... Um, And then I guess shoving could be a thing. Yeah, I, I think shove actually. I think shove makes a lot of sense here. And we'd have to bluff some like, I don't know, ace four suited and hearts and stuff would be pretty good. I think two X part makes the most sense here. Yeah, we fold. I don't really want to do, I'm not sure about doing some like, I don't know, kind of normal size. Uh, 10 inch up queens, what goes check check. Um, I don't think I like check here, so again, gonna go for big bets. Slight over bet, I think, makes sense. And we get the call this time, which is nice. From Ace King High, okay. Uh, flopping top set here. Very aggressive player, so I'm gonna bat here. Um, because I expect to get check raised pretty often. So we will call and see a turn. Which is clean. We have the nuts as it stands. Cannot really do too much in the way of raising here, I don't think. Maybe because he could have deuces. I, I can still have like queen deuce and shit, actually. Um... I mean, I guess I'll just do this exploitatively, even though I'd, this isn't really much of a thing. And we see the worst river card in the deck, the Nine of Diamonds. So what is going to bluff here? Ace-10? Uh, do I want to fold, though, versus... I mean, I am going to have some 10 jacks, and I am going to... No, I mean, I'm not with the size, but... So what do I be? Ace is he turning queen jack into a bluff? He should. I think I call because he's super aggressive, but I'm going to lose this most of the time. Okay, ace jack with a diamond, nice. I'm on a very high roll, so we're going to go for the four back bluff with king jack offsuit. And get called, which is not what we want to see, to be honest. Probably just going to quarter pot range this board. We can actually go bigger if we want. Not having a heart is kind of good because you'll have some ace jack and ace queen of hearts that are auto folds. Even versus this size, I would have thought. Um, I got a couple of options. I could bet turn a shove river. Having a jack is kind of nice for this. Maybe a queen. No, because he shoves queens. 
Um, I think Ace Jack could make a really, really good triple here. Um, but yeah, I think I think I'm gonna triple this on uh, non spades. I'm gonna triple because you can have Ace Queen of Spades, Ace Jack of Spades. Yeah, so I think this is an okay hand to triple. And aces it'll be the most likely value hand that you'd have in tens, I guess. Okay, we've got some showdown now. So, a little though, because I do think he uh, improves a lot on this card and wins. So, um, But obviously now we don't have to fire the rest in. So I expect to lose to aces, tens, and like ace, queen of spades here. Or ace, seven of hearts. Fuck off is that thing. I'll call a three bet here. Blind on blind with king seven suited. Um, I don't think four betting makes a lot of sense, given that he just called me with a seven suited. So in position, he's... If he's calling a7 suit out of position, he's going to call a fuck load in position. So. Uh, and then we flop two pair. If he goes for the big bet, I will check shove. Turn gives us a full house. We like full houses. Down here, we check call the flop. We're going to lead the turn and bet the river. If he just calls. Still uh, want to bet straights as well, so... I think this is a pretty good play from us. We're going to go for three checks with the king seven. I've got like a, a, a million spots here. Checks back annoyingly with queen eight off. So we gave him some room. <laughs> and we just ran into the nut. Which is nice. Uh, down here, we've got trips, and we block Queen Jack, which is nice. And then he folds. What happens when you peel four bats with a7 out of position? I mean, it might be fine. It might actually be okay to call, but it seems a little bit loose. I should bat small here, I think. Uh, I'm on a really low roll, so I'm going to check. Um, we limped up here, just because this guy's super aggro. And playing 40 big, so we have three bet and have us to fold a lot. So I think um, doing this is fine. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna check raise versus this size here. Um, just because I think he's gonna have a lot of like jacks, uh, tens, kings, stuff like that with the size. We lose to queen jack, but obviously he's just got queen jack. The ace is. Come on, somebody, somebody, somebody do something, come on. Come on, key battle, let's battle. Okay, yeah. Making sure when it's vice is on. We're gonna four bets. With our aces. Because it's aces. Calls. Uh, two, four, five. I don't think he should have any sets. Um, what kind of size do we want to go? Quarter or third? Somewhere in between, I guess. Don't go VIP. What's happening? You have queens. Uh, King, interesting one. Um, I guess just something like this again. Got loads of spots yet again. We fold. Down here, we bat flop turn and river. He folds. Uh, three bet ace jack here. Um, get led into on this board. We will float with the ace of hearts. Uh, he should probably have over battle check now on turn. He has check and we'll check back. And river, we will probably back call.
This money has about good lots of them. There's a world where he turns um, something like nines or fives into a bluff here. So I'm going to back call. Uh, I don't like the sizing, but I'm not folding. Just to shove and put me in a spot, you dope. Do you think I'm going to fold an ace versus that size? Well, that's four a bet. And get called. Range bat, I think. Fucking like aces and queens and king queen suited is pretty nice. Uh, super weird one now. Do I want to try and allow like tens to bluff or something? Maybe. I'm going to do this, I think, and then call a shove just in case he mm -hmm. wants to try and turn something into a bluff. I think it's probably the highest DV. Probably just all the jacks. I've got a funner. Hmm. I'm gonna go with the check and a little run. I think check raise makes sense for the hand. Again. Yeah, we're gonna check raise, yeah. Uh down here we flat pre. Uh bat flop versus check, bat turn. I'm just gonna shove river. Snapped by eight. Jesus Christ. Um, I don't really know what to do on this turn now. I guess just like this and then shove rivers. Gonna run into jacks. The nine's a pretty good card. You shouldn't have that many nine acts. You still have aces as well. Shouldn't have king queen. I guess king queen of hearts. And shouldn't really be in there. I guess just shove and, and hope. Uh, I don't think check-in has much benefit. Because what's he really going to... Yeah, it's kind of hoping he has that ace-jack suited or something like that. Yeah, ace is nice. <sighs> Good news is I've got quads. And bad news is nobody has a king. Uh, sevens. We're on a 97. Easy call. Hello. That is top set. I do like top set. Not just any set. The toppest of sets. And he bets big as well, which we like. Probably not having too many raises against this size. We'll just call. Turn could be good. It could be really bad. It'll slow him down with some hands and he can easily have aces as well. Um, but we just call, I guess. I swear to God, if he has got aces, it's absolutely grim. Because he's just got aces against queens. Um, on this table. And it's set over set. Uh, and I guess we just shove here. Um, still. Because now we can bluff some... We can bluff hands like king, queen, or spades. Um, we don't really have those, though. That's the thing. I mean, I'm still shoving. I don't know what we'd bluff, though. 7 8 suited. 8 9 of spades. Yeah, expect him to fold a lot. But, uh, interesting spot here. We call a 3 bat. Get king, queen, 9. Uh, probably just call in. I'm just wondering if I'm going to just absolutely blast off with this hand or not. Probably not in the ace. Even though we're low down in range. Just has too much that continues, right? What are we trying to fold out realistically? Let's check back. I might bluff over though, because we have some um We have some flushes now. 
What's he do with like jacks with a heart that was ever just terror? Yeah, I am gonna bluff here. Yeah. Nice, we get it through as well. Uh, we three bet here. We get a really grim board. Um, and then I guess I'll just do this. Check to the river. Am I expecting to see this player have raises? No, what a fucking stunning river that was. Absolutely stunning river. Can we take it down with a 10 9 suited as well. Uh, we call the three about seven eight suited on a very high roll here. Um, I'm not exactly thrilled with chat raising. Get it in. I, I guess I could raise and then. Uh, I am gonna lead this turn. We probably have a similar amount of flushes, but there's just a load of hands I don't want to check back here. And then I'm gonna bet really small. And then very, very sigh, call a shove. <laughs> love to see it. That's basically all we beat, but people love doing it against the tiny sizes as well. <gasps> this is super weird. So be crucial, can't have ace queen here. You, you can't really have any good hands. You shouldn't have any good hands. I'm calling because I want to keep this guy in, but the board's going to run out like pretty shit sometimes. Okay. Um, I swear to God, if this guy's ace queen, it'll be so dumb. Queen nine. Ace three off. Jesus Christ, don't do it. Um, okay, absolute beluga. It was nice of him. Split his money. It was really nice of him. I'm Kings, we are going to 4 bet here. Uh, make sure we run it twice is on. Should we get shoved on? Have the occasional shove here, but not high enough roll. On calls, we see a 10 4 3. I am going to bet uh, one third and then shove a lot of turns versus call. I think I'm still going to shove this turn. I don't think he has that many flush draws. Ace queen suited, and sometimes that's going to raise flop. Um, we have less than pot. I mean, I guess there's a world where we're drawing dead, but he still calls queens jacks. Ace 10 suited and stuff. I think shoving this is okay. Let me take it down. I'm not sure. I don't think solvers will do that. I don't really want to check. There's still... The, the main thing we have to consider when we're shoving is are we still getting called by worse hands? And I think the answer is yeah. And it's super easy to balance. When we have ace-queen, ace of clubs or ace-king with ace or king of clubs, we can just jam that turn. And I think people would think we're doing that. And I think hands like nines with a club uh, are likely to call the... Uh, high roll down here. So we're going to defend fours. This guy's 3 bent quite a lot. Uh, awkward bud. When we are going to continue on that. Maybe without a club. Nah, I think with the backdoor straights, we, we do call. I don't think I'm going to do much in the way of bluffing here. I'll tell you what's nice, though. <laughs> We've just drilled the fuck out of this turn. <laughs> Check call flat versus small. I don't really want to raise here, but against that size, I'm just going to have to. Hopefully, he's just inducing with aces. I end up folding turn versus just over half pot with the fours. Okay. Uh, I think just calling here. And then praying for a nice river. Just how about the seven of clubs? Yeah, that sucks. Honestly, when he shoves, do I just fold? We don't really have 5x, so I guess he can potentially have ace-king. I wouldn't surprise me if he's got aces. Okay. Check, check. So we win. 
Well played, sir. <laughs> we have three bats. We have Ace King. I uh, get called forward, but we're going to show up here for sure. Not in love with the spot, but this guy's been three batting a lot. One fold, one call. Ace Queen, nice. Wants to run it once. Come on, baby, hold it. No queen and what else? No five or ace. Definitely no queen. Nice. Really nice spot. Love to see it. What am I doing here? Holding, I guess. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Running really well at uh, 500 at the minute, so. Oh, hello. Uh, we call a 10% bat on the flop and turn trips. I don't think I'm going to lead here four way because there's just not a lot of shot that I'm going to be bluffing here when we are four way. If we'd have gone heads up or three way, then I could definitely lead the turn, but four way, no. Uh, we also don't have a good kicker with our five as well. Um, yeah, and then we'll bet River, something like this, I think. It's a bit of an awkward one. Uh, we get called here. There's a chance that we chop. There is a world where we lose. Shouldn't be that much of a world, though. Yeah, King 40, River 2 pair. That's nice. Real nice. So here we're going to go half pot. This is under the gun versus big blind. And I think half pot. And then I'll probably give up River. Because big blind isn't supposed to three bet hands like nines and tens very often here. So when he check calls turn, I don't expect him to have those marginal hands. I just expect him to have... I expect him to fold ace king on the turn. I mean, maybe there is a world where he has ace king, but... And so, yeah, I'm actually not going to bluff this. I expect his range to be jacks, queen x, aces and kings, and then maybe some like ace five suited. And a lot of those hands uh, can hero. So I'm going to check back here, even, even though I don't think we ever win. <laughs> I am glad I did not bluff into quads. Yeah, we defend queen nine suited. Check, check, flop. The turn is pretty miserable. Um, I still guess calling here. We can still improve. And I think I might have to check raise this river. What else am I going to have here? There's bluffed. Yeah, check raise this river all day. But depend on sizing. If you like over bats, then I actually think call performs better. Yeah, we're going to check Rose here. Uh, to something like this. Uh, we're just going to call some 10x. And um, ace x and stuff like that. So I think this is a really nice check raise bluff. And we get it through, which is nice. So we will check raise some queen jack on the turn. But I'm basically range checking that turn so i'm gonna range check the turn so i don't really lead out my jack queens the only thing i will say is that i do check raise queen jack some of the time so just start trying to do this let's go smaller because the a lot of these regs three bat like the three the three bat and blind on blind 30 plus percent how do they always just have a hand now what do we do with ace eight ah <laughs> guess call down now Blocking aces is nice. Block ace jack suited. Still has like, what What does he have? King jack, queen jack, maybe 10 jack. Yeah, so I call river now and then that's what you get for four bet and ace eight off suit, man. I mean, I don't know how many people are going to bluff river here, but he really doesn't have a lot for value. So he doesn't have jacks. He can't, he can't have ace jack. So it's basically one combo of aces and then six combos of jack x maybe. Yeah, six combos of Jack X. Uh, I fall back for value. I got a limp. I need to I need to develop a limping strategy. This guy's three bats just insane. Um BVB. But I never have good hands when I limp call or I never limp raise either. Not often. Uh Bat Turn and River. 
I don't expect him to fold turn a lot, but... I mean, I could overbat if I'm going to bat, right? We do beat some King Tan, some King Queen. Do they bluff forever, though? Don't know. I think he's going to have a lot of Jack X here. Or Tans. Yeah, and if we bat big, he might call that hand as well. Uh, picking up the Kings. Yep, that sounds about right, doesn't it? Well, I flopped Jin here at 500. I'm just going to raise. Oh, I mean, yeah, now we just show for it. On a 99 as well, so all in. We, we run it. I mean, we're basically flipping against aces with a diamond. That's like worst case scenario. Ah, oh, drill the first one. Come on. Diamond. So many diamonds. Shit, should have run it once, boys. Should have run it once. We're going to see a turn. It's a really, really good turn. We're going to check back and call unless he 2x bot. Yeah, I guess we'll do this. Ace Queen's still a possibility. Sixes and threes possibilities. Just wonder if he ever has like four or five and then check shoves as a bluff. I don't like this sizing, buddy. Why have you gone so big? I've all an Ace Queen suit though, am I? I'm a grown up. Let's get stuck by Ace King. Nice sizing on the flop, buddy. Come on, give us a spade roo on the river. That's a spade a roo. Um, I'll go for the check shove, I guess. Unless I want to bet small and give, like, kings... Yeah, I think, like, small bets here is actually really good. Gives kings and queens... He doesn't cut have queens. No, because he... Yeah, it gives them room to call or turn their hand into a bluff. Which I don't think happens very often anyway, but... Hello. <laughs> now, if he snap folds versus the shove, it's perfect. Because then we've got the match. Okay. He just has King Queen. <laughs> what a fucking run out. What a ridiculous run out. Right, three bet here. Uh, do I want to risk getting check raised? And do I want to just realise here? Yeah, I'm just going to check back just for fucking sake of ease. And then we don't mind when we... Um, if we get raised now, we get raised. Maybe I could go smaller than that. I mean, yeah, I, I guess I have to call, right? Yeah, okay, cool, because there is a well where he has bluffs as well, so when he checks river, we'll shove if it breaks. Uh, luckily, we just river we just river a straight. I mean, he could have 9-10, actually, so maybe I should have considered that. Okay, yeah, so there is a world where he's just randomly bluffing, and then, so when he does, uh, he might give up on river, but I guess he's not really going to give up on river. So. Uh, it's a good last hand to, to call it, though. Uh, this guy's a fucking idiot. <laughs>